Now looking at the economy, Minister of Defence gets highest recurrent expenditure in 2021 budget as Nigeria increases investment in national security and human capital development. Minister of Finance and Budget and National Planning, while presenting the breakdown of the 13.08 trillion naira proposed budget, says reforms are accompanying the document to critically address present revenue challenges. Leah Katung Babatunde completes the story. The 2020 budget, which became effective January 1, was revised mid-year due to disruptions to the macroeconomic environment posed by the COVID-19 pandemic. 2020 will see the global economy contract by 4.9% as projected by the IMF, Sub-Saharan Africa 3.2% and Nigeria 4.2% as projected by the National Bureau of Statistics. The 2021 budget of economic recovery and resilience seeks to reposition the economy for growth and already initiatives have been put in place to improve revenues. The integrated revenue monitoring system is designed to ease revenue recognition. E-Customs approved by the Federal Executive Council and ITAS that has been implemented by the Federal Inland Revenue so are also being implemented. The TSA implementation are judged to be today the best in Africa is also being strengthened. We have also put in place specific provisions that help to promote social inclusion with the exemption of small businesses from certain category of taxes. Currently, for every 10,000 tons of food that is produced, about four to 6,000 is lost. It doesn't get to the market. And so we saw this as a low-hanging fruit and decided to provision to ensure that food that is produced can get indeed to the market and that we can encourage investors uh, to come up with a value chain or value-adding industries around the agricultural corridor. Expenditures put at 13.08 trillion naira, comprising statutory transfers, sinking funds, debt service, non-debt recurrent expenditure, and capital expenditure. Revenue is projected at 7.886 trillion naira, with deficit put at 5.196 trillion naira inclusive of income from 60 government-owned enterprises and projectile loans, a first of its kind. 13.08 trillion of expenditure includes 1.35 trillion naira of expenditure by those um, 60 government-owned enterprises. The Federal Ministry of Works, Finance, Budget and National Planning and Health topped the proposed capital allocation list in that order with critical allocations to education and health. The parameters and fiscal assumptions for the budget proposal include an oil benchmark of $40, daily oil production put at 1.86 million barrels per day, an exchange rate of 379 naira to the dollar, 3% GDP growth, and 11.95% inflation rates. In Abuja, Leah Katumbaba today, NTA News.